Hello, hello, and welcome to Coffee Craft. I am your host, Anon Jr., and uh, we're, we're getting ready to go on to Plan B, because I got some good news and some bad news. Good news. This helmet, my uh, plus one Koopa shell here, uh, I took the two helmets that Arcadius gave me, I put this guy on the enchanting table, and I got everything except for mending on the first go. So, I slap a mending book on that, and bam. Beautiful. Pretty much what I wanted. Mending, yeah, mending, and breaking three. Uh, aqua affinity, respiration three, and uh, protection four. That's the good news. The bad news is, I went to go make a demolition suit at the same time. Uh, where, where, where is that? And... I got the chest plate going because we don't we don't have a villager that sells blast protection uh, and I need that to run the TNT stuff <laughs> to break bedrock on the nether roof uh, trying to do that without I found out the hard way last last time in season one that trying to do that without some blast protection gear is not advisable so uh, I, I got the I got the chest plate after mm, many many tries i i got the pants after many 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 more tries and i still haven't gotten the helmet and the boots so like i, I used up my good roll right off the bat on the turtle helmet which uh you know what i'm, I'm not i'm not going to get too mad about that i'm going to get a little cranky about that but i'm not going to get too mad about that uh while i was trying to crank up the XP and all that, I did get a few other things going. I'm trying to work on a little bit of decoration. So, uh, I, I got a couple of paintings. I got what's supposed to be a tree. Or a shrub of some sort. I don't... I'm not 100% sold on that. Uh, my problem is, is that every other type of tree or shrub that I know to how to assemble and put there the green either clashes or blends in with the uh, warped fungi planks there. And, and so so the, the red nether warp blocks kind of kind of made the only fit. And I tried a bunch of different stuff in the potted plant, and those branches are really the only thing that work. Uh, everything else is either observably too short or uh, it doesn't connect right it doesn't blend right it doesn't work right uh so yeah I, I i might come back and revisit that i also wanted to do some banner art uh maybe, maybe string a few different banners together up on the wall to to get get it looking like some big tapestries up on the wall uh <clears throat> and i put a balcony for that room up there we'll get to that in a minute uh I don't mind the balcony itself being out of the same material as the wall, but the the green the green fence just it's not fitting. I I don't I don't know what to change yet. I haven't I haven't quite figured that part out. I might uh, I might go up with some cobblestone wall and iron bars, so that'll have the same fence as this. Although, I'm not sure I want to put the half-slab cap on there. Because uh, ha having those uh, fence gates there mean I can jump down instead of having to walk all the way around. I don't know. We'll see. I did also put the uh, the roof on here. You'll notice it's a little bit lower than it was previously. I dug up forgetting that I was going to put a second floor up there. And so I had the roof of this floor ab uh, about two two to three blocks higher than the floor of the uh, the room above it. And, and that that was not... No. No, we, we, we couldn't do that. So I, I lowered the roof a little bit. And uh, I like this kind of... I like the, the gradual stair-step, gentle... Not quite dome, but I might do something like this out here because I've been trying to figure out what to do especially since I don't have a whole lot of space on this side here uh, and I know I'm gonna need to taper it back a little bit so I might I might taper it back one or two blocks and then 
and then cap it like this so I can start so I'll have a flat roof to hang uh, chandeliers and decorations and things off of so that that's that's a that's a high probability on the next go round. I did not do too much over here this is pretty much as we left it at the end of last week where hey Arcadius yeah, I, I tried that too. The the green bamboo, it, it's not. No, it's not working. And as long as you get an empty hand, you can grab whatever's in the pot without breaking it. Don't don't go too far, because uh, there, there's more. <laughs> but wait, there's more. Um, over here, I did get a little more decorating done in here um, I, I moved uh, an anvil and grindstone over by the enchanting table I got a barrel set up to drop some uh, uh, which we call it into and I started throwing some more shrubs and plants around this is one of the variations I got some moss blocks and an azalea tree in the pot uh, that doesn't look too bad I've been trying. I've been playing with some different ones too because the, unfortunately, I can't do a flowered azalea. And if I do that, it just looks, it looks weird. No, you can. You just need to put two azalea uh, things above it. Yeah, I thought about that, but then we get the leaves where it's a little more transparent, and I have some on me too. So don't think that that's not something I'm going to play around with. Because I tried a different version here using the, the whatchamacallit, the, what's it called, uh, dead bush. Yeah, and that works better with just standard leaves. Yeah. Uh, this foliage is just too thick for that kind of a base. Uh, when you use the, the azalea bushes as a base like that, it really highlights the fact that there's just this really dense set of roots that are all blooming. Yeah. So you can put stuff like the moss on top of it and it blends well. Whereas this seems more like a, a tree and you need something a little less heavy on top of it because you can actually visibly see how thin that root stem is. I don't know. It could be a bonsai tree. I also tried the same deal with the uh, the moss and a uh, bamboo over here. Also, Java. This is the room that I, that I started putting together, so I've actually got, you know, a bedroom, a grandfather clock, uh, you know, some other decorations. Uh, I don't like that awning. I, I was trying to go for a canopied bed, but something about that just, I don't know. Uh, I was also hoping to hide the, uh, the end rods there so I can get some more light in here without, you know, torch spam and... Uh, throw the lights behind the uh, Jabba and behind the painting behind the bed. That should be enough with the new uh, zero rule light system. Yeah. Oh, you like the shoes that I got tucked uh, tucked aside under there? That's <laughs> They're on an invisible armor stand. I haven't figured out what I'm doing with the top yet, though. Uh, well, I mean, but, you've already got one light hidden up there. Yeah. It, it was not providing as much light as I thought it would. And I, I kept trying to build a table over here, but every table I started building knocked the painting off the wall, and I wanted the Jubba painting there. So, <laughs> decisions had to be made. <laughs> I mean, you could put a lower table down here as if it were a shrine. You're praying to the almighty Jubba. No, no. <laughs> Look at that face. Is that is that the face that, that inspires fear or anything other than a... Oh, exactly. Exactly. I, I I also need to figure out. I I think there's a way to put higher resolution pictures as paintings now, and I need to look into that. And maybe uh, maybe touch up some of the paintings and put something a little different together. But th this is where a lot of the weekend went. Uh, <laughs> putting this together, I was tired of having the bed on the balcony, and. It, it took a little bit to come up with the quartz floor. Um, I, I'm hoping x -Medic Frog would kindly put together a uh, quartz mason. I mean, a stone mason 
um, in the relatively near future. Yeah. I know I moved one of the uh, Fletchers to a, a, a more permanent home. So that <laughs> should free, free up at least one spot. Oh yeah, no, there 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 is one other spot in there too. Uh, I also I also keep thinking about expanding this balcony out one more block because it just feels a little too narrow. No, well, maybe it depends on how it looks from the ground down there, honestly. Well. Because down, down here, it doesn't look like it, it's as narrow as it feels up there. I still don't like that fence, though. No, it all blends in yeah. too much. Um, I think that needs to be like this. Well, let's, uh, while we're here... I gut that entire thing off and rebuild it with this pallet that you have on the stairs and the railing up there. That was not my smartest move. Oh, well, you know, <laughs> if it works, right? <laughs> uh, well, I mean, it's more of a if you survive it. So maybe something like that and like that, and then... I forgot to grab the uh, slabs. I see you found the back end of your island. Are you, are you uh, working on that. I, I was I was getting there. <laughs> yeah, the, this is also what took a fair chunk of my time. I, I've been digging out this back room, and uh, somewhere around here is a tunnel that goes down and out to the side of the mountain. I found that out the hard way when some uh, some guests, uninvited guests, came. That has been sealed off both here and out there, and, and it also extended up this way into another part of the mountain, which uh, allowed some uninvited guests to show up. And so it is sealed up up there. And I'm going to dig the ceiling up higher. I just haven't figured out how high yet, because I'm not entirely sure what I'm going to do with this room. I wanted to see how much space I had, and those ice blocks are the outer edge. So I need to yeah. either, like, start tapering it further in, because, I mean, we're almost there. I could, I could just stop the room here and make this a little bit wider entrance hallway. Mm -hmm. You know, make, make it a 3x3 three three hallway with a gravity door, like, up front. Put like a dwarven head out front, and you have to walk <laughs> into the dwarf's open mouth to get. Oh, this is all there. supposed to be the back entrance. Well, I mean, family friendly and all that. And uh, I, I knocked out that hole over here because I wasn't sure if I wanted to make uh, an entrance into this room from both the main hall and out back here or not. I mean, this is a pretty room. I think you did a decent job of... Getting there. No, it, it looks nice in here. Especially these guys. How are you stopping them from growing down? Oh, uh, okay. Mm. Stopping what? I see the string now. Never mind. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, those guys. Yeah, yeah, okay. yeah the glowberries. Uh, the, the almighty string. <laughs> Good thing there's a spider farm nearby. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I went to go poke the glowberries to, to show you what I meant, and I, I finally noticed the string poking me in the chest. Yeah. It's like, oh, well, oh, never mind. Yeah, so so there's string under some of these, and, and I put, you know, some of the leaf piles under others. Okay. A couple of candles here and there just to make sure there's enough light. Yep. Hello? What is the light level of a glowberry, anyway? Uh, well... Not relevant for this discussion because under, is it here? No, here. Um, I put some of the lighting under the moss carpets. So the candles and the glowberries are just decorative light. 
Well, in that case, drop it down to like some threes and ones and stuff. Yeah, I well, honest, honestly, I'm I'm thinking of getting rid of the candles in here because now that I got the glowberries, they don't make much sense. I can see that. That that does make that does make a artistic. Uh, what leaving the candles there makes artistic sense, or no, getting rid of. Them. Oh yeah, I mean because one of those knocks over and this room's gone. <laughs> 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 Yeah, Let, let's just say that there are days that I'm very happy we turned off Fire Tick uh, many seasons ago. Well, I, I don't think you can actually knock over a candle. But yes. No, you can't, but I'm still, it, it's, the, it's the principle of the matter. <laughs> and uh, I also started digging out the space here for the two side rooms coming off of this side. I don't know what I'm putting in them yet beyond... Uh, at least one of them needs to have a stairway down to the basement. Okay. And have you charted how much room you have if you've already touched blue there. If you've already hit ice there at this line, have you charted how much room you actually have to go in that? Direction? Oh, I got I got a lot here because where the back entrance is is, is a little bit of a V in the mountain. Uh, okay. So, I, I'm not too worried about that on this side. So what's in the basement? Oh, that's where the bee farm's hiding. Well, that's where the temporary bee farm's hiding. In the, uh, you, you need a uh, honeycomb or... Yeah, I just stole a stack. Okay, that's <laughs> fine. <laughs> uh, no, the these boxes here are, uh, the beehives are for the two big farms I'm going to build either in the nether or in the end. I haven't decided which yet. I'm leaning towards the nether because that's going to be easier to get to and from. Okay. And then this will just be for, you know, private stock. Okay. And uh, this thing, I, I mean, I only built it two weeks ago and it's already overflowed two double chests. And is Whoa. producing a bunch of bone meal. <laughs> well, they're over there eating half your crop up there. Hey, they, they earned it. <laughs> I, just, I, just, I, I just see them eating through so I don't like yeah man. yeah no no I got surplus they they, they could they, they, they deserve it they're working hard because they got the pig in there they work day and night so you know go ahead knock yourselves out <laughs> you sound like a fast food manager <laughs> we got surplus I mean <laughs> if it fits <laughs> But uh, I do, I do want to do a larger version of this once we find a place to put those farms over, maybe over at the castle or. Why? Why? <laughs> Why what? You've got double chests of it, and it's already overflowing to make. Over yeah, and we're gonna have a bunch Why? of the villagers that'll trade for that stuff when we get the castle fully populated. Which trader buys this? Oh, the butcher. The butcher. Uh, okay. Yeah. Okay. We're we're talking about having at least one or two butchers in there. He, yeah, I need I need them for the kitchen. You're right. Yeah. I need two butchers. I, I I I mean I like emeralds. I don't know about you. More things to trade means more emeralds. True. True. Granted, I don't know if that's a guaranteed trade though. So. Uh, actually, let me double check. Shop I got the reference off to the side here. Uh, graphic. That's not like the best reference list I've ever found. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> uh, armor Butcher. Um, actually, the sweet berries are a guaranteed trade for a Master Butcher. Oh, no. What's the other Master Trade, then? There is no other Master Trade. Like... Oh, wow. Yeah. So the uh, the kelp blocks are a guaranteed trade for expert, which I didn't realize until you had me look. And uh, now, now I, I definitely want to get a massive kelp farm that cooks it automatically, um, so we can start trading those kelp blocks too. Because, like I said, you know the 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 frustrating part with the armorers and weaponsmiths over in the current trading area is once you're done trading iron with them, like, that's all we got. So that's it for the day. Uh, that's not true. We've got tons of librarians now, and we've got the farm to make uh, paper. Yeah. So. 
but but uh, but you uh, get what I'm saying is the more yeah. stuff we can get to trade per villager, the better our our ability to massively get emeralds is going to be. So instead of relying yeah, on just one, goal. like it, as long as we get somebody that takes uh, chicken, uh, I can you know I can get a nice chicken farm going. And one that doesn't lag the server out when you throw the part potion of harming. Yeah, really. <laughs> that's, that's a perfectly feasible farm. Thank you, sir. Dude, you lagged out a local computer with that. <laughs> well, I mean, there were a couple dozen time dozen time dozen chickens in there. A couple but, dozen you know. flocks of chicken. <laughs> I mean, if you needed 30 levels in a hurry, that that was a good way to do it, but... I mean, it worked. Yeah. I don't remember you complaining about getting levels. No. <laughs> Just what to do with all the chicken. And that's where the butcher comes in. That's true. We didn't have a butcher back then, though. Where did all my pressure plates go? Hmm? I had pressure plates on most of these doors, and they seem to be gone. Why? You're inside a house. What do you need pressure plates for? So I don't have to... So <laughs> Because some people <clears throat> uh, forget to shut doors behind them. Yeah, but you're in a house. Why? <laughs> well, it's like Star Trek. The door opens up as you walk towards it and closes behind you. Oh. What? Don't know. <laughs> All right, so that that, that was that was, that, was the, that was the main thing I wanted to start with were the decorations, and I, I definitely wanted a second opinion on the azaleas over here with the moss blocks, because uh, one of the, the there was the azalea, the flowering azalea. I mean, we could try cactus, but that seems like the wrong kind of green. Uh oh, where'd you go? Oh. oh, I'm in the wrong room again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's upstairs. It's upstairs. upstairs. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. No, this is good. Uh, no, get rid of the. Get rid of that. Yeah. Uh, I I also thought about an oak sapling, but that doesn't seem to connect no. right. It's not that it doesn't connect right. From any angle that you look at it, looking downward, it just doesn't look strong enough to hold it. Well, and then we've also got using some of like the uh, azalea leaves. And that's a pretty way to go about it. And then, Unless you have a stick or a uh, yeah, dead bush. Because you could do the dead bush. Uh, that I don't know. That's okay. I really think that when you're using the leaves, though, the dead bush works better. Yeah. That, that's kind of where I was. Yeah. Uh, like this guy here, he's more like a hedge, and you want that thick base on him. So this this yeah. looks good. I like this one, and I use it uh, when I have builds that need that sort of thing. But this guy here is something I use actually more frequently than I use this one. Well, because we had, didn't have moss until now. In, in, in a different server. Anyway. Yeah. We were behind the times for a little while. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Sky block and all that. Anyway. So yeah. No, this is a good design. I like it. Alright, then uh so it, those it two really are set up. Depends on how, how you want to set it up. Let me go I got a I like the way it looks. I brought a bunch of extra resilient. Like, I had have you been digging up all my pressure plates? Huh? No, of course not. <laughs> you bum. <laughs> I almost got away with it too. <laughs> yeah. take something out of it when I can't fly away. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> like, oh, uh, that is the other thing. Um, 
I would absolutely like to, uh... Keep changing that. Oh, yeah. I, I forgot the slabs. We, we got distracted. Um... <laughs> If I were me, I would have put it. There we go. <laughs> Wait. Yeah. Okay. That's the azalea. And... <laughs> You're rummaging through my... Uh... Well, I'm trying to figure out where to put this... Uh, uh, I'm holding. Trying to put what? Bamboo. Oh. Boxes it in. I know you have some. Actually, I, I, I do over in the bamboo farm. It's in your tree box. <laughs> yeah. Uh, this hot mess needs to go. And, and get, like, I, I need to bring so some of that down to storage. Downstairs? I, mean. <laughs> I, I don't know. Uh, oh, but uh, this season, if you and Medic are up to it, one of the things that I would like to do is figure out the maximum number of portals you can get from killing the end dragon and do that. And then make a giant... 24? Huh? Is it 24? Yeah. For some reason, I thought it was 16. It, well, it's every major compass point. Yeah, 16. Okay, you're right. Okay. Um, and then uh, and then build a giant uh, safety pathway to all the different portals so we can leave notes on, on stuff and uh, you don't have to worry about moving up precarious stairways <laughs> and just kind of build a, build a nice little end hub, for lack of a better word. You know? Maybe do something to to mob proof the island so that way we don't have a bajillion and two endermen floating around. It's flooded. <laughs> yeah, I'd I'd rather not take that route, but uh <laughs> I feel you. That's kinda ugly. Yeah. But 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 you get the idea to go do something like that. Mm-hmm. And the other thing I'd like to do, and maybe we can work on that now, although I'm not sure what materials to make it out of, I would actually like to, to build up our uh, safety box in the nether. So that way it is both a little bit safer and a little less cramped and not suspended over a lava lake. 20. 20? Uh, according to... Random archive. It's up to twenty uh, Ender Dragon oh. gateways can be spawned. Huh. Okay. I didn't realize it was uh, that many. Man, <laughs> and why twenty? That that is the weirdest number for Minecraft. I mean, for something that seems so so diligently focused on base 2 counting like stacks of 16 stacks of 64 etc etc uh 20 is just a really weird number in that respect oh well i got nothing for you. I, <laughs> I got nothing either. either there's a lot of stuff on this game i just scratched my head once and tried to forget about <laughs> yeah yeah i hear you on that part too all right, so you want to go build up a, uh, a little safety spot in the nether? You still haven't fixed that thing yet. Oh, oh, that's right. I haven't. <laughs> <laughs> We're not leaving until this is done. All right, all right, all right. Let me get to it. <laughs> Down to my last few baked potatoes. That's okay. I, I got to... Oh, it's probably right up there. I, I hear I hear a zombie dying. And it's like, um and then I realize that ice is like right at the level. I mean, I like this, but it kinda defeats the purpose of having <laughs> a, 
it just feels a little too high. Uh, okay, build that out one with a step down from the door. And I also meant for you to actually rebuild the entire structure, like the entire oh, cone. Oh, okay. That way the entire cone was built out of the structural block of the the dark stone, the stone. Ah, gotcha. That way it gave it a little more, like, it's there and it's structurally sound. It's not just a wall placement. Uh, so that means I'm going to need more brick stairs, which I have. Oh, hey, if you hate it, tear it down, redo it. That's what Minecraft's about. Yep. <laughs> Don't believe me, ask uh, Reyes, Chief. Yeah, <laughs> no. I rebuilt her base like five times like two seasons ago. Nope. Not going there. Not on a dare. <laughs> uh, that part's going to have to wait until I can get more blackstone. Oh, okay, well, put up a sign. Do you have a sign? Uh, I have a bunch of signs floating around here somewhere. Do the random slab go? Never mind. I, some days. I left myself a to-do note. Right there by the door. <laughs> so what are we going to... Oh. <laughs> Putting one every which way. Signs and I, I was wondering what was taking so long. Like, like, okay. Uh, the thing that took so long was finding the arrows on the keyboard. Oh. I use them so infrequently. <laughs> so I'm sitting over here staring at my keyboard, like I know you're here. I know you're here. <laughs> yeah. So what materials do we need to grab to do this, though? What do we want to make it out of? Stuff native to the oh, Nether, yeah. or do we want to use up all the tuft we've been collecting? <laughs> I completely forgot what our task is. What are we doing? <laughs> <laughs> we're, we're, we're building a, a bigger safety box on the nether side. So that way we, we've got a little more room to work. You know, there's an ender chest like right there. Yeah, well, you said nether, so I'm putting my bed away. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Some harming arrows if we're going in there. Well, you shouldn't be harming anybody. Do you do you have gold armor anymore, or? Yeah, I've got it. Okay. Gotta grab a shield. Grab a cake. You know, you always need cake in the nether. Mmm, cake. You have any more nautilus shells? I'm like four or five away from having another. Uh, five, four, four away. I have one. I gave you all the other ones I got. Oh, add it to the box. Oh, okay, I'll add it to the box. <laughs> Three away from another conduit. Yay! Oh, that's yeah. Right. All my other chests are full of sugar cane right now. <laughs> really? <laughs> oh, I should probably grab... Uh, I think I got one more... 
Yeah, I get one more extra ender chest. I'm, I should leave that over there and then other. I mean, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta go ahead. Speaking of our special hats, uh, the only thing I got when I put both my turtle shells on the thing, on mm -hmm. the bench, back to back, was they both came off with Unbreaking 3 and Aqua Affinity, back to back. Wow. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I got a massively lucky roll, and then everything else I went to enchant, um, well... Yeah. I think I went through about a stack of lapis and only got two of the four pieces. Here, check this box out. Uh-oh. This is my future equipment box. Just <laughs> loaded out of piece all that together. Nice. Mm, yeah, I... I do need to put, um... I need to upgrade the soul speed on these gold boots. Oh, good luck, because that... I don't know what it is about soul speed. Mm -hmm. No matter when I put it on, it is always astronomically expensive. Uh, well, because that's part of the soul speed. I guess. I it, it wouldn't surprise me if that's wow. the case anyway. I got a bunch of crimson stems, but I, I don't think we want... I, I'd like something with a little a little more blast resistance. I don't know why. I mean, I don't know. Feels like making it out of moss blocks. I was about to ask you to throw away pickaxe. Um... I do that, because I can... I, I've got one in my house that's in my... Little base across the way there from the start of the season. I walk over hey, there. Hang on. Uh, as far as what we're going to build a, this out of, I got an iron pick for you. Oh, okay. I'll take it. Just in case, you know, yeah. unfortunate things happen while we're there. I don't want to lose my pick. Oh, so you're going to lose my pick? I told you I had one in my base right over there. Oh, she said, take this one. <laughs> <laughs> no, take it. <laughs> That's the one that I was looking for uh, a couple of weeks ago, and I couldn't remember where I put it, so it it, it was tucked away where I wouldn't lose it. Oh, Lord. <laughs> All right, hey, what, what what materials do, you, do we need to grab? Or are we going to build um, this out of stone since, you know, we got bajillions of stone? Is this supposed to look pretty? I mean... It's just a box around our portal, right? Uh, it's supposed to look protective. Well, what we already have is quote-unquote protective. Are we moving away from there to build another one? Or? Uh, well, I was thinking... Explain to me what the deal is. Okay. Because that's what I'm struggling with. I got two, two problems. I need a faster door. <laughs> Alright, I'll meet you over there. Well, that would be the other benefit of killing the Ender Dragon twenty times. We well, get a stockpile of uh, wings. Uh, I pulled my bed away. Sleep. Uh, sorry, I'm working on it. I was gonna want. It. What you... Let me sleep. <laughs> sleep. Oh yeah, I kind of forgot that we had all these drowned heads over here. <laughs> Put them in as the servants in the castle. Yeah. <laughs> I've been saving up on all the... Uh... Um... On all the um? Retired. Uh, oh. Villager. Yeah. They have a pretty high chance of dropping. You you wouldn't imagine that, but they do. I'm already up to three Fletchers. <laughs> that says anything. Yeah, I gotta... I gotta get...
going to get back to this project at some point too and start stacking a couple of these on top of each other. Of course, now that Medic's Farm, uh, Slime Farm is working beautifully, uh, that's, that's less of a problem. <laughs> so I can start stacking this up as many as I can fit up to uh, the AFK platform. Ooh, ooh. That's the goal. Uh, that's part of why I was working so hard to get more Shroom Lights. Although it doesn't have to be Shroom Lights. I guess I could go trade with the Cleric for uh, uh, Glowstone or glow, lamp, glow Lights. True enough. Oh. There you are. The farm up there is completely filled with everything except... Sugarcane, uh, yeah. Sugarcane at the moment, and that's because I took four shulkers full. <laughs> yeah, I saw that. I saw that stack of rockets over at the uh, castle. Oh, oh, I forgot to. Hang on. Okay, so facing north south. Oh no, I still have all that sugarcane on me. Oh. Really? It's in my shulkers in my uh, my in chest. Yeah, I'm I'm taking it back for paper. Gotcha. Yeah, I was gonna trade it with the villagers. Okay, to be fair, I wasn't gonna trade it. I was gonna oh. leave it out with a note for Reyes to trade it. But you know, that's like a favorite hobby. So it's like, hey, twist my arm, right? <laughs> well, that was weird. I couldn't figure out what that noise was. It was the squid dying up on the on the netherrack here. <laughs> okay, because I, I don't think the... A, I don't think the portal is lined up correctly there. Well, again, I'm going to come back to... Does it matter? Because this is a temporary setup no matter what. I thought the goal was to get on the roof. Oh, the goal is to get on the roof, but just like in season one, we need a safe place on the on the under the roof too. Well, this ain't it. We need to go somewhere else for that, like a hundred blocks somewhere else. Because <laughs> I, I just it was a good idea to take over the island over there, but uh, if this is where it wants to <laughs> put us when we come through the portal. Is not so cute. <laughs> well, that, that's why I wanted to check the uh, the coordinates. Oh, okay. All right, negative one sixty, sixty-five, forty-eight. Okay, no. Other than the elevation, th this is actually where it should be. It should be five blocks higher, but that's about it has nowhere to go five blocks higher. Yeah, well, that that's why it, that's why it ended up here. Because when it was calculating where it needed to go. But no, I was talking about maybe putting some windows, get something a little sturdier than netherrack in the walls, maybe expand it out a smidge so we could put supplies and whatnot before you go adventuring, that sort of thing. We could, we could expand it to take over this room. I mean, that would yeah. be too big of a stretch. Um, also, does this staircase go all the way up to bedrock? Um, I don't, not yet. That was one of the other things I needed to do, is build a pathway up to bedrock. So that way I'd have a place to actually break, break through. But I would really like to get it as close to over the portal as I could. Over that one? Yeah. So that way, like in Season 1, we could stack the portal for the roof over the portal for the nether proper. Okay. But I forgot where I stopped on the, uh, the ascent. So we're there. Start going back this way. Oh, I was getting ready to just start, uh... Hi-ho, hi-ho. Are you uh, collecting some more basalt? Yeah, I still gotta get that. What you're the stairs at, though. I still gotta get that basalt generator going too. I just don't know where where I'm gonna put it. 
I've been looking up different uh, TNT type chambers. Did you smooth this basalt? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I did. Oh, uh. <laughs> Mr. Chainmail, you might want to be careful. Oh! Get your okay, you do have your gold on. Good. Hi! I'm about to go capture like five of your <laughs> uncles and put them in a trading hall. <laughs> that solves some of our uh, blackstone shortages too. Yeah. Although not as many ender eyes as I would have hoped. Don't really need ender eyes anymore, do we? You always need ender eyes. Come on. Seriously, what, what use do they have now? Uh, anytime you need to get in or out of a particularly uh, tricky contraption. Those are pearls, not eyes. Oh, yeah, sorry. Pearls. Oh, okay. I was like, uh... Something here not adding up. <laughs> Words. How do they work? Oh. There are days I don't know either. They usually end in Y. We're at bedrock. Okay. And are you above our portal? Next uh, No. But I, I can I can work on that once I actually get above the bedrock. But that that's not gonna happen today because I don't have I don't have the stuff together for uh, getting through that anyway. So yeah, th this should be a good place to get through there. I definitely uh, need to spend a little more time in that Ray's Works video, though. Dude, <laughs> dude built a flying machine that you can AFK at to remove strips of bedrock. What? Yeah. He figured out a flying machine so that you can AFK and remove strips of bedrock. Of course, if you want to remove the next block over, you got to completely tear down the machine and rebuild it. So, you know, it's not without its drawbacks. <laughs> but still, I, I mean... Dude's crazy. That's one word for it. Uh, but go. no, the, the video that he demos it in is well worth watching because he goes through a variety of other smaller machines that he that you know were part of the development process that are great for if you need to remove the block next to this one or above this one or below that one. And it goes through all the different variations of bedrock breaking machines. And, and does a pretty good job uh, of breaking down, you know, no pun intended, uh, how well they work. There you go. Hmm? There you go. Oh. Grazie. Yeah, I don't need this stuff. Oh. <laughs> really? Not my favorite block. Like if you're making like a petrified tree or something, you know, down. But otherwise, I are I medic and I the only two that actually use that much? 
Yeah, maybe. I don't know. I'm just not a huge fan. All right. Well, I mean, the top of it's good for blending in with like a cobblestone pathway if you're like yeah. randomizing it. But uh, again, otherwise, I, I just don't see too many other uses. All right. Well, if we're not going to build that out, uh, you know what else we need? Huh. Tons of magma blocks so we can build our first farm once I break through the roof. Cool. You, you know which farm it is. <laughs> huh? There were some over where we were digging for uh, digging with beds over there. I hear a squishy. Yeah. Cause there's a squishy. Go away, squishy. Go away. Nobody likes you. I don't know. Who doesn't like uh? What is it? The no, it's not the fire resistance. Is it the strength potions? No, it is the fire resistance that the magma cream. fire resistance. Okay. Blaze. Uh, Blaze is the strength. Yep. We just go over here. Try not to die. <laughs> and you wonder why I wanted to make a walkway instead of some torches and just haphazard terrain. Hey, I didn't do this. You say medic for this one. What's up, piggy? How you doing today? How, how mad's he gonna get if I dig up that gold to trade with him? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> no, I, I wouldn't. Be the last time he gets mad. <laughs> I wouldn't do that. <laughs> I'm just saying, Twice. Be the last time he ever gets mad. There's two of us. No, oh, seriously. Like, like. No. Come through the hole? No, what are you doing? There's a hole over there. Right behind the waterfall. Come here. Right here. Seriously? Like, like rather than... Seriously? Like, I... I, I <laughs> really? <laughs> Instead hey, of hey. doing this... <laughs> I, I don't... Hey, hey, hey. I don't even... Straight, straight from the mind of... Medic and Reyes. There you go. Uh, that is not a Reyes move, good sir. <laughs> I was there when it happened. I was there when it happened. Sorry, I just saw a floating gasticle. I figured uh, getting a bow out would be nice. Yeah, well, you know. Okay, that's the mine. Oh. Okay. So this is where you guys been digging for, uh, for, um... This is where me and Rest were doing it. Um, for ancient debris? Yeah. So we were doing all of our <laughs> mining here. I see. Yeah. Can you tell? So, yeah. It, it goes for a little while down that way. No, that's and fine. turns... Not exactly the the best place to hang out. Um, no, we are below lava right now. Yeah. But up here at the top of the stairs, you'll find tons of magma blocks. Again, be careful of lava. I think that's a wall telling you not to go there. So I wouldn't take those. No. But when you're at the level where we're at right now, which is down here at lava level. You'll find pockets like that one over there where there are tons of magma. Oh, yeah, yeah. And there's tons right over there, too. So, there you go. We just got to start picking them up. All right, find a spot and let's start digging. There's a stairway around here that is uh, less dangerous. Uh, i got to walk it out for the big yeah. pigs. I also need to get Frostwalker on my boots. Well, I can't do Frostwalker and Depth Strider, and my next big project is going to be uh, decimating a temple. Oh, I'll yeah. Uh, well, no, I I keep these gold boots for nether work, and uh, I think, yeah, they've got Depth Strider on them. 
I'd rather I'd rather have Frostwalker on my nether boots, so that way I can do stuff like working on the. Don't go down. <laughs> yeah, I see. Don't go down below the one I just picked up. So you can grab that stuff, but don't go down any further. <clears throat> Let's uh, no, that's not what I wanted. Try to find another pocket. Yeah, just walk around the edge here. The other way. Yeah, I, I was like, that did not look like the edge to walk around. No. Actually, oh no. Okay. We just want to poke a hole in the wall and look for another, another that way. Well, I was wondering if this one didn't expand further back. Hang on. Let's uh do a test poke. Pick up what's there. Nope. 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 <laughs> still, still That's a nope. <laughs> test poke denied. We're leaving. Bye bye. <laughs> Swimming today, not doing it. Yeah, I died like five times before he asked doing bed digging. That was oh, <laughs> <laughs> did uh, yeah. Like it might be. That's solid. Um. Yes, yes. Let, let's continue the vein up. No, no, no. Up, up, up. Probably should have brought a potion of fire resistance with us. Well, considering I have almost an entire chest full of it for us, yeah, that'd probably be <laughs> Yeah. I figured healing and fire resistance were the two major ones to make right now. And yeah. So I made a ton of them. That's a start. This way. I just wish I could remember how much we needed for this project. I know, I know it was a number of stacks, and honestly, I don't. In the shelter box counting range. Uh, pretty close to. I thought it was like two or three shelter that we put down. Uh, that I don't remember. I honestly wasn't prepping for that because I thought I was going to get through the nether roof quicker. And then, you know, uh, sad reality had to have its say. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you, you, you need what rolls on the enchanting table? I'm sorry. Try again. I'm sorry. Your enchanting is on another table. I saw one of the best uh, cartoons over on uh, one of the discords that uh, for a podcast I subscribe to. It is old school Nintendo Mario. And 
Princess Peach is laid out. There is no, and the caption is, there is no princess, only Zul. Let's uh, let's see just how much '80s nostalgia we can uh, cram into one one reference, shall we? I gotta be very careful not to hit that gold, or our trip might be cut a lot shorter than we want. <laughs> I don't see any pigs here. Go for it. Uh, yeah, you won't see any pigs here until I go for it. That's the problem. Be a chicken. There's no pigs here. Get it. All right, then you go for it. I don't have the sword or the pick for it. I don't have fortune on this. I don't have fortune on this either. I got silk touch. Well, that just means you can do it later. You sure you don't have fortune on that? <laughs> oh, I do have fortune. Sorry. Okay, fine. I'll do it. I'll do it, chicken. Where's the I'm not with him. <laughs> oh, that didn't sound good. Oh. Did you think the pigs found me? <laughs> well, I actually, I figured you had stepped in lava or something, and like. like do we need do we need lava rescue? Like, is that the nether version? Yes, they will get angry at everyone. You you can shout, I'm not with him, all you want. They don't care. All they know is that a player made them mad, and you are a player. Matter of fact, I, I hear that if you're uh, AFK in the nether. Um, you can cause serious problems for your cohorts. <laughs> uh, they can. It depends. If they are still angry at you and more people join, then yes. The people who join in will also be angry at you. If uh, you eliminate anybody who might spread the message, then you can possibly get away with it. Uh, you just gotta watch out for the four kids in a van with a dog. Or bring Scooby Snacks. Decent pack over here, too. Matter of fact, I'm at the point that I really probably ought to. This. You got a shulker. Yeah, I got a I got a couple of empty shulkers. one for those guys, and I do want to keep the netherrack and basalt. Because I do want to, uh... Oh. oh! That was, that was almost very, very bad. The downside to a very efficient pick. <laughs> Did a little too quickly. Yeah. I mean, there are times that that's a benefit, but where lava could pop out of any brick you uh, accidentally pop, uh, that's 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 less less of a benefit. <laughs> All right, now, now I'm a little disoriented. Am I heading towards the lava or am I still heading away from the lava? <laughs> well, if you're low enough, you'll be near the lava. <laughs> uh, 
I even gotta remember which way is out. That's the way out. Oh. Oh? Oh. My pick broke. Oh. <laughs> You couldn't have told me beforehand? It doesn't have mending on it. it did, it would have gotten repaired with the, like the stack and a half of quartz. <laughs> um, get my good pick up. Huh? <laughs> I just got my good pick. It's fine. Oh, okay. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Don't break that one, too. I won't. Mm hmm. Let me leave myself some, some signposts. Like, this is the way out. Of course, the other thing to... to consider is uh, that Bastion has one of the magma cube spawners, right? Uh, yeah. Because if you get a, a magma spawner, uh, a magma farm going, you could just turn all the magma cream into into these guys. Good luck with that. Uh, yeah. I mean, I see it and people talk about it like it's no big deal, but, uh, <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm not so sure it's no big deal. You know what I mean? <laughs> like, well, considering I died twice there, and even medic died. Yeah, there. medic died multiple times trying to get your stuff from when you died. Yeah, because that's where the elytra went off to, isn't it? No, no, the elytra went off when I tried to go get more elytras for us. Ah, for us. Okay. And. uh yeah, I shouldn't have done that alone. The first couple of times you go, you should never do that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah. The the uh, shulker shulker hunting and all that is definitely a uh, buddy system endeavor. Most of the time, yeah. Once you're late game and you've got like epic Uber gear, you know, go ahead, have fun. Ah. Uh, even even then, I tend to prefer you know phone a friend and <laughs> oh, 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 nope. Ah. Well, at least I didn't lose everything from that. Some uh, put stuff away before bad things happen. Nothing bad is gonna happen, sir. Don't talk like that. Allowed to talk like that. Fine. Put stuff away so I have more inventory space. Okay. You can talk like that. That's fine. I smell coffee. Yes, and I still have half a cup in front of me. <laughs> like, 
definitely time for a sip. <laughs> Be careful going down. There was a lava pool not too far from here. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Well, I need a little bit of that. Just the way it is. Because it looks like uh, ribbon meat. But the rest of the church, you can have fun with all the courts you want. I'm going to laugh if we accidentally our way into another bastion or something. Eh, if we do, we do. Another chance of getting a uh, lodestone, right? Y yes, that too. Something. Granite, down by that magma spawner, is another... Uh, loot chest that we can't get to. So, so what yeah. Kind of loot it's got? Huh? So I don't know what kind of loot. Yeah, careful. Have. There, there's lava on the other side of that. Is that lava up there? Yes, that is lava okay. up there. Okay. Where's your shulker? My inventory is like slapped. One's for magma blocks and the other's for everything else. Uh, I need some of that quartz back later. The ore. All right. Yeah, careful. The lava pool's not too far away from there. Yeah. Pretty good idea where it is. And I can see it from there. Hey, hey, hey. Take the blocks uh, out from under Is that nice? I didn't mine any blocks out from under you. You just can't jump. Well, you know. Oof, up there. Oh, what do you think about the new uh, sneak enchantment that they're getting ready to release in the uh, next update? Never heard of it. Hey, more. Uh, when since one of the things you're going to need with the warden is the ability to sneak by him, it's an enchantment that you can put on. I can't remember if it's just for boots or if you can put it on more than just boots. Uh. But it allows you to move at a faster rate when sneaking. Careful, the lava is very close by, and it looks like this outcropping is uh, hanging over it. Yeah. So you can get uh, sneak one, sneak two, sneak three. And it will let you move faster when you're in sneak mode. Not just in the in the dark, but uh, anytime. So uh, one one of the things that the developers was one of the developers was trying to point out is that will also help with building because uh, how how many times are you crouch yeah how many times are you trying to crouch to avoid falling off a ledge or something while you're uh, while you're building. I see a lot of people getting a lot more use out of it like that than the other one. Uh, unless you're playing on Bedrock. Because Bedrock, you can't, uh, the, the, you can't place blocks while crouching. Oh, or something like that. I, I, I forget the specifics. I, d I just know that Bedrock players can't take advantage of it. 
Like, literally, the only advantage they're going to get from it is the increased uh, sneaking speed. Full stop. Why does anybody buy this? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> uh, well, you got to remember, Bedrock started off as the mobile version of Minecraft for uh, Pocket PC, PlayStation, PlayStation Portable, uh, all the consoles. So that is all Bedrock, as well as the PC version of Bedrock. Where where the big conundrum for them is going to be is how 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 do you get some of the parody stuff together because there are going to be some hard decisions like Java Edition has certain redstone features that Bedrock doesn't have and vice versa and they're the kind of controversial features that you know some people are going to love and some people are really going to hate and uh so I mean what do you do I'm a little disoriented I can't remember which direction the lava is this do not break this wall but okay that's lava directly behind that we should be pushing into the mountain this direction here same thing with that wall over there oh <laughs> yeah this this wall here that i'm facing is the lava wall so don't mess with it You know, and there's some things in in bedrock edition that i really wish they'd bring over to java like in bedrock you can bone meal any flower and get a second one. Test poke and we got some more. Nice. Uh, you know, not just the two high flowers. In, and in bedrock, you can bone meal sugar cane to get it to grow faster. The flip side is, is that when it's growing naturally, it grows slower than in Java. So what do you want? A faster grow or to be able to accelerate it? Yeah, that that is a uh, that that is a very valid question. Like you know, you know, I don't know. On the one hand, it would be really nice to set up something like the two high flower farm, where I need you know I need fifty sugar cane, so let me just throw fifty bone meal into a dispenser and uh, let it rip. On the other hand, uh, that AFK sugarcane farm uh, that I got going now, while it will technically work in Bedrock, uh, it's going to be painfully slow. So how do you how do you square that circle? Well, you just don't make circles in a game that you can't have, man. <laughs> Smart. Thank you, literal. <laughs> yeah. For another base, I almost want to put a floor of magma blocks and then glass above it. Sounds cool. What's this up here? That's the lava that we uh, passed by here earlier. So that's, our, <laughs> that's our wall. Want to do one more test poke and see if we get more? Nope. I think you don't know how test pokes work. That's, that's a tunnel. Well, yeah. And I found more. <laughs> Careful. There are uh, people nearby, so don't go busting up any gold or opening a chest. Oh, I want fun out of it. Well, look, you can take it up with them. Matter of fact, let, let me go poke this gold right now, and uh, they'll be happy to come meet you. I'll be flying away. <laughs> we'll be back soon to get your Elijah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Before I go too much further, let me uh, empty out the old inventory. Uh oh. 
I hear some guests. Ooh. Uh, one shulker box completely full of magma cubes. Did you mute your mic or something? Because it sounds like you're... <laughs> huh? Sorry. Where's that shulker? Uh, the shulker box is full. Uh, or the shulker yeah, box is nearly full. You got, you got another one? Uh, not, not that isn't uh, set, set aside for a project. I thought this was a project. Yeah, uh, except it's already full of the materials I need for that project. I just toss it on the floor. It'll, it'll go away soon. Uh, <laughs> okay, so you want the sugarcane farm to go slower? What do you mean slower? It works fine. Uh, you just got to AFK there more often, that's all. No. Every time I fall in a hole here, my heart stops. I know. <laughs> I know. Each hole you're like, this, this could be my last. Some, I can't remember if it's out now or not, but uh, I know 1.18.2 is supposed to be either out soon if it's not out already. And it's got a fair number of bug fixes in it. Which uh, should be very nice. little vein and then get make my way back to uh, back to home is even yeah call that good enough. Also, I need to give Beach Duck a hard time. I don't think I've seen her yet. So, how much of this do you need? I don't remember. In my Arcadius, your, your voice got awfully uh, different. Also, we're running into the problem of uh, space. Unless you get an empty shulker box hanging around in an ender chest. Oh, wait, no. You're on Arcadius, so... Uh, yeah, we're, we're running into space constraints. Well, I'm just asking because he's, like, full up on this stuff. Yep. Uh, that, would, that would make two of us. I got... I get room for a couple more stacks in my ender chest. Oh, he's got room for a couple of stacks. He's just, like, it's getting to the point where normally I'd be shoving stuff in my shulker box and... Uh, yeah. My, my spare, my empty shulker box is full. Both of them. Do you think you have enough then? Uh, we definitely are a good way there. Because I don't, I don't remember. This, this was not my original, uh, intended project for today. But I couldn't get my full set of blast resistance armor, so uh, yeah. Now I gotta remember how to get oh, out. Your 
Oh yeah, Th there's lots of sadness. Don't go, do not, do not go digging up any gold. Um, which, which way was out? There doesn't appear to be an owl. Uh, did somebody cover up the way out? I feel like the way out got covered up. That's not terrifying at all. Oh look, it's a way out. Oh, hang on. Uh... Oh no, don't jump in front of my shot! <laughs> that would have been... Okay, and he despawned before I could... Uh, okay. Do we need any of this? At some point, but not not just yet. Why are the little flamey characters standing on top of each other? Because they can spawn in like that randomly. Huh. Uh, you can also, a little more rare... Get them stacked higher. I, I forget how high you can get them stacked, but each one that spawns in has a random chance of having somebody on top riding the strider. Okay. And I've seen, I, I have personally seen them stacked three high, but there have been screenshots floating around of them getting taller than that. Where are you at? Board. Oh. <laughs> it's very clicky and bouncy. Also, I probably need to fix my uh, pickaxe soon anyway, so. Huh? Hi, friend. We'll be back for you later. Oh, not you specifically. So now that we got our way up to the roof, I just need to finish my suit of blast protection armor. And then, uh, and then go from there. I was trying to talk to Arcadius about putting together a more, a little bit larger and more secure portal for, uh, this side of the nether than just, you know, a square of nether rack hanging over the lava. Do, do you have any opinions of that, or...? No, because I don't go here. <laughs> Alright, let's head back to the overworld. Oh. You closed the door on me! It's, a, it's on a go. button. It closes on its own before too long. Oh, uh, I put some flint and steel on a, uh, on a... Which book call it? Because I, a, a creeper accidentally got in here when I was going to make another another voyage okay. and uh yeah he 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 bloated up the uh the portal i didn't oh. i didn't know he was on the other side until i went through and he said hello I'm trying to leave an ender chest over here he has a lot of sugarcane on him yeah, he. Uh, I thought the sugarcane farm was doing worse than it was, but apparently he he went and grabbed like a whole bunch of it. Oh, okay. So now I'm wondering if it was really as bad as I thought it was, or or just you know it got pillaged that thoroughly before. Oh wait, no, it is doing as bad as I thought it was. All right, I'll need to expand that out. Uh, so where are we going? Because he doesn't seem to have wings. No, he doesn't have wings. Um, they got lost. Oh. I was going to sleep first, and then we were going to head back to uh, somewhere that I could temporarily put the uh, all the magma blocks. Okay. I don't know if you want me to hold on to them or put them in the caldera or uh, put them over at the castle storage. 
cover. All right, let's go put them over at the caldera. That'll be nice. Wee. Bouncy, bouncy keyboard. <laughs> you really don't like the the. I hate it. Really. I have a hard enough time with jumping games, and when I have to double jump, and the key is, like, bouncing back in my hand? I, I yeah, I don't know. Like, on a good day, I cannot do the clickety jump, and this does not make my life any easier <laughs> is out. Uh, we never actually made a proper path. That was on the agenda, but we never quite got that far. And I keep finding a random horse tether in diamond armor tethered up, but I can never remember where he's at. That's strange. Not the strangest, but strange. Isn't it your horse? No. Just your tunnel. It's right here. It's my tunnel. I did not put that horse there. Oh, I thought you put that horse there. No, it doesn't have a name. Someone name it. Nope, it's just a horse. Of course, of course. It's the diamond armor that kills me. <laughs> like, like some horse just chilling in the ground with diamond armor. Am I crouched? Feels like he's going slow. Right, you get a double tap to run. Or shift, I think. The aforementioned issues with double tapping on spring keys. Yeah, I know, I know. Uh... Um. Um. Ah. What? They have names that explain their presence. Oh, those two guys. Yeah, I thought you knew about them. Nope. I knew you were going to put them over here. I didn't realize that that thought had come to fruition. Oh, yeah. Uh, let's see here. Oh. We should put this... We don't need this much room for sand right now. Why? I got a box over here. Already ready for the... Oh, I didn't realize you did. What's in this one? How are you doing? How are you oh, I was going to put the red nether wart stuff in there. And I need to, uh, I need to get another... I need... I forgot to make another chest. Do we not have a quartz box over? No, guess not. How you do? Nope. How you do, hello? Well, that's definitely a good start. Hello? Hello? <laughs> I got a box. I got a box. Uh, got a box. Hey, 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 hey. Are you sure you don't want to put a double chest on that one? <laughs> How are you doing? Hi. Hi. How are you doing? Did you see what both of those guys trade? How are you doing? How are you doing? Mm -mm. I haven't looked at them yet. I mean, they're headhunters, so I assume our heads. How are you doing? Yeah, you, you should definitely take a look at them. There we go. Hello. Hello. Hi. Sure. Ooh, those are pretty. Those are the gems. How are you doing? Oh, he sells llamas. No, he buys llamas. Hello. 
Oh. Oh, he get. Oh, oh. No, you do. Oh. <laughs> well, I mean, every season we end up with an excess of, uh, of uh, wandering trader heads for some strange reason. I, I fi- That's uncomfortable. Now we've at least got a use for him. That's uncomfortable. What else needs a home? We already got a gravel box somewhere around here, right? Yeah. You know, like the furnace setup? Does it furnace? Yeah. And the nice thing is, is you don't have to do anything. Just put stuff in the input box and let it rip. Why do I keep... Oh, yeah, this is over here. Okay. Yeah. I know. I need to work on an off switch. That is, uh, that is definitely on the agenda. Oh, none of his armor is mending? Uh, no, his mending armor got lost. Oh. To time? In memoriam? Or like... Uh... I'll let you ask him about that at some point. And they have stopped talking. Oh, don't worry. They'll be back. It doesn't take long. The sound was just getting like... Oh, yeah. No. Uh, I, I really need to work on an off switch so that way you only have to worry about that sound if you're... I also don't understand how he listens to it like this. What do you mean? Uh, he has you going in both the Discord and on the stream. Oh. How you do? Oh, so you get the you get it twice in a delay. And myself. Hello. Ah, uh, okay. <laughs> so I'm hearing you talk to me, hearing myself speak to you, hearing you talk to me, hearing myself speak to you while I'm continuing the conversation. Okay. Yeah. I mean, I like re- I like reverb as much as the 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 next guy, but uh. And he has like different volumes, so it's like this faint. It just it's weird. It's really really weird. Okay. You know, if he's done eating, he should probably be ready to take his computer back over. Hold on one second. Okay. Oh. Hello. Hello. Hi. Hello. Hello. That is definitely a start, though. How are you doing? Actually, let me hang on to the magma cream. I'll go bring that over to my uh, brewing stand. Or, no, I'll put it by the brewing stand over at the uh, the main base. Not the main base, the castle. Mm, we're okay on lapis over here for the time being. I think I remember that there's a little bit of redstone there. Uh, I should probably grab my fortune axe, but that might be later. shouldn't show Reyes this, but, uh... uh... I'll wait until she's at one computer or another. Oh. 
I mentioned I was uh, doing all that enchanting. This is where it was happening. I, I spent a lot of time killing spiders. Uh, one of my random shulker boxes is full of wool. Is one of the things that I'm thinking about doing is since I'm tasked with uh, the dining room floor, I'm actually thinking about filling it in with wool blocks like it's a giant carpet. But I'm not I'm not a hundred percent sure on that one. Give any idea to massive uh, ornate windows or tapestries. Uh I am I am thinking about doing a stained glass window off at least one side. And I just haven't figured out if it's gonna be an abstract design or something in particular. By the way, I, 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 oh wait, no, you saw this the last time I used it. Mm -hmm. Also saw it when you built it. <laughs> yeah. This is still... 16 is a start. I want to see if I can figure out how to make this work with 32. 32 furnaces. You mad at me for throwing items on the ground. Look at all that carpet. Well, it's got to keep up with the furnaces. And no, it's not going on the ground. It's going into a fire pit. So anything not pulled up... Anything not pulled up by the uh, the system goes into a little fire pit down at the end here. The only problem is when items get stuck on the carpet like that. Eh, it's okay. It's like, what, four items? They'll go away soon. Yeah. But, uh, that... That was a stack of glass right there. Alright. Let me, uh... I think some of your stuff has already been mended. Did you know that you can actually uh, climb up the yeah. glowberry vines? Mm -hmm. that, that's one of those things that I, I did not realize. Oh, that's what I should do. Okay. I've been trying to figure out what I was going to do for the pathway up on top of the nether roof. Can I do it in the glowberry vine? Do it, yeah, yeah. Do it with a glowberry vine. How are you doing? Hi. <laughs> Either that, or I could do a chain because we've got the climbable chains data pack. I mean, a chain would feel a little bit more nether appropriate. Yeah, it would. Uh, and since since I got the uh, honey block farm, I was actually thinking about a honey block slide down and a chain for up. <laughs> oh, by the by, I I know I know uh, Reyes was was, was kind of getting a little twitchy about the randomness around here. Now that I get the small sweetberry farm, should we take these guys, some of these guys out, or I would think so, but with them being right in front of Medic's door, you might want oh, oh, to oh, talk to him shoot, first. Shoot! 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 I forgot. I still have my, I got my gold boots on, not my uh, leather boots. <laughs> Alright, well, let's put that in there for now.
Let's um, swap those out. <laughs> okay. I mean, again, I, I love that uh, that leather boots now have a purpose, but I definitely, I still gotta get to the cleaning out the snow. I know you got that uh, snow golem over there for picking up more blocks, because I wouldn't mind. I, you need that. I gave you like five thousand snow blocks. Yeah, I know they're they're over there, and I, I've been using them to repair little places where I accidentally poke through without a silk touch axe. <laughs> it happens. Yeah. Uh, but I wouldn't mind digging up a little bit of the dirt and putting snow blocks because we do need to figure out a way to light this up. Uh, I I I have there there have been some drive-bys uh, from skeletons <laughs> as I have left my base. <laughs> Here's a crazy question: Can you put? snow layers over the top of like a light source? No, because the light will melt the snow. Uh, that that that's why over by these torches is clear of snow layers. Well, that's torches. Could you do it with like a, it, It's not uh, it's not about heat, it's about light. Uh, it okay. it melts in a certain light level or higher. I forget what that number is though. Okay. Well, that answered that question. Yeah. I mean, it'd be nice. Don't don't hear what I'm not saying. No. Wait. Uh. Science. Oh, oh, oh yeah, the snow layers. Uh, yeah. Look, if we're going to go all science, then you shouldn't have a dirt block suspended in midair on nothing. And a piece of string should not stop a cactus from growing. <laughs> well, I mean, if you're looking for physics, you could play seven days to die. But, you know. uh, no. <laughs> uh... Uh, at some point, we're going to want to get to lighting that, too. Oh, yeah, I did go through part of that. Because I, I know when we were doing our lighting session last time, I went down one cave somewhere over there, and I ended up just outside the mob farm. Like, over by the lake where the mob farm is. I, I didn't realize I had wandered that far away from the area we were trying to light up. Yeah, those caves are massive. Yes. Oh, I know you I love Seven. Can we bring one of the mules into the nether with us next time? Why is there sand are in the glass box? The nether, or what are we doing right now? <laughs> uh, I I have no idea what I'm doing right now because again I, I expected to be building stuff on the nether roof and and that didn't work out. We we solved a fair amount of the decoration question that I that I had over uh, at my base, which was going to be part of it. Okay. Well, oh, uh, you know what we didn't grab while we were in the nether? Blackstone. Well, okay. Because that's what I needed to finish uh, finish the, the, the design. Yes, yes, that's what Bilbo Baggins hates. How about the right box? Alright, let me go grab some blackstone real quick. several chunks of it where we were mining. Like, I know. I uh, don't... Away. I know. It was right there. You know where else it is? Right here.
I swear one of the noises it, it, that they added to the nether, the ambient sounds, sounds like a radiation something or other from Fallout 4. I can never hear that effect without thinking like, when did they get Fallout in my Minecraft? I mean, granted, there are parts of Fallout 4 that look like it could be straight out of the nether. You like New Vegas, right? I like the story of New Vegas. Because I, I can't remember if you were on like when I mentioned rule that rule they were... Uh, that they, hmm? I can't remember if you were on or not when I was talking about uh, they, they've got uh, Fallout New Vegas 2 in the works. Yeah, I think we yeah. talked if not, I've read it. Because um, they're also starting a Fallout TV show on Amazon. Oh, really? I'm curious to find out how that works out. Yeah, Amazon's going to be hmm. uh, running it. It goes into production like this month or something. Oh, speaking of Amazon Video, uh, you know what Cord Killers recommended? Vox oh, Machina. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh it's, it's good. Yeah. Uh, if you haven't watched it. Uh, I've caught a few episodes with you and Reyes here and there, uh, but I have not, I have not sat down to actually like watch it, watch it, and I need to fix that and start at the beginning. I will gladly start from the beginning with you. Oh, I, I kind of figured you would. Uh, and and I do, I do eventually need to go through the Mandalorian. Um. And the Mandalorian side quest, also known as the Book of Boba Fett. Oh, oh, oh dude! <laughs> I saw the best meme for that the other day. <laughs> have you been Have you been watching that one? Because I, I know you watched the Mandalorian all the way through, but I can't remember if you were watching Book of Boba Fett or not. Uh, no, I uh, lost access to Disney Plus. To gain access to something else. And, okay. Yeah. Uh, no. D try <laughs> playing, playing that wiggly round thing. So. Yeah. No. I. I understand I'll completely. Back around. Yeah. I'll, I'll circle back around and get it later, but for now, no. But I did see a meme about it the other day that I thought was hilarious. It's got a. Apparently, the book of Book of Fett's not doing great by itself. No. So all of a sudden, uh, Mandalorian <laughs> shows up in it uh, a lot. Um, uh, and the meme is basically uh, the Mandalorian, someone's cosplay of the Mandalorian sitting in a recliner at their house. <laughs> and it's uh, they get a phone call and it's got little text bubbles, you know. Uh, Boba Fett needs saving or whatever. And it's just him getting up and... Uh, <laughs> Dusting off his uh, pants from the chips he was oh. holding and grabbing his staff and walking towards the door. <laughs> Out the door. Yeah, uh, to be fair, I am reasonably certain that they planned for the Mandalorian to show up in the Book of Boba Fett. Like, I don't think that was a, oh no, the ratings, we need to save the ratings move. Um, however, comma, uh, you should definitely go back and listen to the spoiler in time episodes on the Book of Boba Fett. Um, I don't think it will ruin your appreciation for the show. It especially give some of the things that, you know, it, it kind of, it, it definitely helps, uh, how shall I put this? Can you give me the cliff notes? Because... The way, the way I've been lately, uh, we'll, we'll say busy lately, <laughs> um, there, there's no guarantee that I'll uh, find the time to circle back to it. <laughs> uh, well, that, that's what, that's part of what I was saying. Spoiler. Sorry, uh, go watch I'm Spoiler sorry, in Time. We're, we're, playing, we're playing Minecraft. There, there, there's little chance that I'm going to find a chance to square back to it. <laughs> uh. No, that's why I recommended spoiler in time. Uh, like I, I, 
For me, a lot of the Spoiler in Time episodes I watch, I have no intention of ever seeing the show that they're talking about. So it is a, a an excellent Cliff Notes, or Sparks Notes, for those of you born after the late 1900s. Uh, <laughs> that doesn't look right. Is that really the, the change? Because I remember when it was like always cliff notes. And... Uh, yeah, no, that, that ch it changed to sparks notes. Sparks notes. Mm hmm. I can't remember when that change was, but it was definitely after, after 99. Oh, yeah, I know. Where, where's Pink Geek when you need the answer to that question? Because <laughs> it was Cliff notes when I was in school. Yeah, don't, don't. When I was in school. I mean, when, when you were in school, you had to walk uphill both ways and through the snow and... All right, I don't... Do I do that? Or that? Or is this where I need to pull it out one more so I can get a little more gradation in there? Yeah, wasn't the original thing to pull it out one and have it staircase down one so that the uh, the railing that you're going to put on it doesn't block the door quite so much and that you, from the top of the stairs, can see over yeah, the Yeah, I don't know what you mean by pulling, <laughs> which you're talking about, pulling down one, though. That's that's the problem that I'm... You, you say pull that down without... Well, what's your... Crosshair is pointing at right now. Well, well <laughs> yeah, yes. Let, let's do that with stream delay. <laughs> <laughs> right now. That. Right there. The entire, like, cornucopia cone that's coming out of the wall. Cornucopia cone. Yeah. <laughs> the shelf. We'll call it a shelf then. Pull that shelf down one. Apply stairs directly as you exit that. Like, have a staircase, like a three staircase right there. Right where the lantern is, or the stream light is. Or... That doesn't, that doesn't change the, the problem. Like, like, this railing, it doesn't matter that you can't see over it, because it's not for seeing over the the problem is the height of the floor relative to to the oh is pinky gone now I do like that that helps it stand out, though. <laughs> okay, do half of what you have as your railing. Just do the walls and the iron rods. Don't do the... Um, the half slabs across the top? Yeah. And if you want to keep the half slabs across the top, do it as w uh, stone pressure plates instead. Uh... Actually... That might... No, well, I don't know. Do, would they touch, or they would be separated? Wouldn't yeah, they'd be separated. It wouldn't It wouldn't look quite right. Okay, never mind. Don't do that. I might just leave it like that. I mean, that's not bad. That's not bad. That's, that's better than any of the options we've gotten so far. Yeah. In my opinion. Take my word for it. It's in a book, you know. Um... Spark notes? Okay, yeah, yeah. 
Yeah, Arcadius was trying to figure out when it switched from Cliff Notes to Spark Notes. I mean... Yeah, that's still a huge gap there, I mean... Yeah. <laughs> it was still Cliff oh, Notes Oh, oh, good. Pinky, since you're on, I want to show you a couple of rooms and see what you have to say. Because I'm curious now. Ignore that hole in the wall. That might be a door to another room. But, uh... It's pink cake. All she's gonna tell you is it doesn't have enough pink in it. I got some small crop farms for twisting vines and flowers and sugar cane. And I got the barrel in the middle. That's temporary. That's not gonna stay there. Uh, bamboo. And more flowers. And the crimson vines. Huh? Although, I am definitely going to get rid of the candles. That's not working. Nope. I'll find another place for those. Also, it's a Java. <laughs> I think this study is about as complete as I can make it. And a honey. I need to get I need to find a picture of Duke that I can put on one of these two. Oh. Didn't know you added a honey. Yep. Well, get getting getting multiple photos of Jova is a an exercise in frustration. Ask Rayast. That's right, I forgot to lock the armor stands. It's like, where did the random hat come from? Did I lose Pink Geek? Or is she trying to figure out how to type it all on a... Uh... That that is a really rude delay. All right, basalt and blackstone. Another right. Oh, I didn't realize I had that another exit sitting over there. Huh. Okay. All right. I'll let that sit like that for for now, and then uh, and then I'll think about I'll think about what I'm gonna do from there. The the red the red trees are kind of growing on me. As much as I, I I know that looks a little thin for what it's supporting, they, there's nothing else that's gonna fit right. We finally have a librarian that's gonna sell you glass. Ooh, nice. <laughs> uh, yeah, I, I meant to ask you about that. Is that new Coke? Is in somebody revived the new Coke flavor, and. Uh, uh, found out why they, or, or was reminded, forcibly reminded of why they got rid of it. <laughs> like, like, uh, how, how many people remember New Coke? Or, or is that only, uh, is that an 80s only thing? That might be an 80s only thing. Beach Duck, you there? You remember New Coke. All right, I got to figure out how how high up I'm going to bring that ceiling. I definitely want to build a balcony off of here. It's going to be a larger one, similar in setup to this one. And from that balcony, I want stairwells going up to the next floor and then down on this side as well. Uh... 
but I still got to figure out how big I'm going to make this room. I know I don't have room to dig it out evenly. Or does that matter? Well, that's, uh, I think that's where I'm getting ready to start poking through on this side, too. Because, uh, this, yeah, we, we got, we're on a weird part of the V, so that's actually gonna, yeah, that's gonna cut off really soon, too. I need to put something big and impressive in here. Maybe, maybe I will make the roof the same height as in here. Which, if I remember right, is just, uh... Yeah. Just out of reach from this level. What was the question? I, I think you're muted. I'm looking at a sign near the villagers that says, Any chance a quartz, I mean stonemason, could appear? Yeah. What's a stonemason? They're, they're the guys that trade for stone and sell quartz and other stuff. Uh, okay. They're the ones that have the stone cutter in front of them. Ah, okay. That's what I need. How do you make a stone cutter? Uh, three stone and an iron ingot. I think I've got some extras over here. Where is here? Uh, out here will be there in just a minute. <laughs> I mean, with as much stone as we have, we, we should probably go ahead and ha get a couple of them, uh, put together. Somewhere along the way. Oh, he is filled up on iron. Uh, yeah, I spent a, I spent a night AFK there. Because I, I noticed that we were all dipping heavily into the iron, and for one of my upcoming projects, I was going to need a lot of hoppers. Oh, thingy things. Hi. Why didn't I pick them up? <laughs> is your inventory oh, full? Okay. Yeah. I didn't realize they were stackable. Oh, yeah. I need to close myself off. Yeah, and I know, I know this is just the temporary setup until we get uh, the castle squared away for them to enter in. Alright, he can't see anybody, right? Yeah. Uh, his first trade is going to be the same no matter what. His apprentice trade is going to be the same no matter what. It's the journeyman that may be different, and I don't know that I'm worried so much about that. The expert will be different, but I'm not too worried about that. And it's the master trade that we're after for quartz. So we can start trading him... Uh, Stacks of stone for uh, quartz. He won't talk to his station. Uh, Here he goes. Yeah, I was getting ready to say it's only ten o'clock, so I don't, uh, I don't think it's that. Do they all trade clay at first? Yes, they all trade clay at first, and oh. they all buy bricks. And I put a bunch of emeralds somewhere so that way we could do those first couple of trades with them. Uh. My brain. How you doing? I put How the you emeralds doing? right where I wouldn't forget them. Are we missing a dude? Uh, missing in the sense that he is no longer there. Missing in the sense that uh, I, I, I got some uh, emeralds for you. Did you pick him up? 
Okay. Yep, I think so. Okay. And and I'm gonna go grab uh, some stacks of stone for the second set of trades, because everybody trades stone, and that's one of the other reasons why we need a couple of stone masons, because we have more stone than we know what we're gonna do with. Inventory space. Yep. What do you have all this? For? Oh, okay. I didn't know those for trading. He's about to level. Nice. What you got? Uh, second level's gonna. His stone trade's gonna oh. be the same no matter what. Okay. That's a yes. Yeah, repair that pickaxe. That's a yes. Uh, gray terracotta and lime glaze terracotta. Um. I'm not too fussed one no. way or the other about that, but uh, it's gonna be some kind of terracotta or quartz. And where he'll buy the raw quartz, and, and I—I I don't know about you, but I ain't selling raw quartz. So what happens if something happens to him? Uh, as long as nobody knows that something happens to him. If you catch my drift, like you know, grab a flint and steel, and an unfortunate fire were to break out. Hint, hint, nudge, nudge. I'm looking for flint and steel. I don't think he has any. Um. Push him outside. Oh. Oh. Hang on. There you go. I'm going to be over here doing my best. I know nothing. Where's the cart go? How do we get more of them? To replace him. You, you send another cart up the up the thing. This wall? Oh. Okay. So good to me. Ah, oh, seriously. Which I did that much you? damage to my pickaxe? Can I trade some of this paper real quick? Yeah. You have so much paper in here. <laughs> Who buys it? The librarians. No, they don't. Yeah, they do. Oh, he does. Well, I mean, not everybody's smart enough to buy it, but... Ooh! He sells glass now! Nice. Um... Yeah, no, they, they don't always sell glass. Which I'm glad they do, because, uh... That, that way somebody doesn't melt up all our sand into glass. Doing. Yeah. Hello. 
<laughs> it's okay. That villager has horrible trades. Does not play well with others. Uh, it, it's after banker's hours, so you're only going to get a little bit out of them. Oh, are, are you are you doing them in because you just don't like the lime terracotta? Yeah. Okay, because you know you can re-dye the terracotta. It's just the glazed terracotta. You can't. Whoops. Uh. No, you send the card up when you're ready for the next one. You you push him out here where nobody can see what happens to him. I will in a second. I can't have, I, I have literally one, two, three, four, five, seven Hello. people talking to me. How you doing? Hello. How you doing? Nudge him. Well, How someone specifically doing? wanted a quartz one, so I was trying to get the quartz one. How yeah, no, doing? the quartz is the last trade for all of them. They all trade quartz. But he's maxed out. Oh, no, he's not. No, okay. he's not. I thought he was at the end. Put no, him back. he's not at the end. <laughs> That's why I was like, seriously, it's just because of the terracotta. Oh no, 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 not that far, not that far, <laughs> not that far. No. Oh, yep, right there. You're going right there. Let me move your station. <laughs> <laughs> okay. See, look, your station. It's right there, where it always was. Let's grab another one. You go get some more uh, powered. Uh, this uh, why isn't it picking them up? Come on. There we go. Oh! Don't worry. Hey, I, I I set up the cart so he'd go into this side here. Where's one of those stone cutters? I put them in the box. Hold on, let me seal up the entrance way. Yeah, that, you guys that would be. be really upset at me if <laughs> if something unfortunate were to happen. Yeah. Come on, it's right there. Go to work, man. Dude, it's right there. <sighs> you lazy bum. You nab me one more time. I'm going to send you out to permanent retirement. I got plenty more where you came from. Oh, there you go. Oh, of course I put all my emeralds away. Oh, okay. He's got quartz now. He does quartz pillar and block of quartz. Yep, they all do. They they all will when they get to the master level. There, there's no two ways about it. That's just one, that's the master trade that every stonemason gets. It's a couple of the middle ones that are different. How you doing? And you're feeling improved. Uh, do you have more of the stone that I gave you? I already used it all. Oh, okay. But there's plenty in storage. Plenty. Oh, yeah. Trust me, I know. Plenty. Yeah. No. 
I'm not. I, I can't. I can't buy myself to buy chiseled stone bricks. Fred Fletcher is awesome. Why is he awesome? I don't know, but I, oh. I need to name him Fletcher the Fletcher. Would that be too on the nose? Meh. Meh. I thought Meh. that was the dragon. It was a dragon. He was so cute. Oh, on uh, on the Giants in the Playground forum, somebody was asking about really unusual builds, and all I could think of was uh, getting a a druid and a warlock, so that way you could do eldritch blasts as an eagle. It just feels uncomfortable. Yeah. Well, for, it will for somebody. Looks good to me. Oh, he sells dripstone. Oh, I, I need to get an updated chart. I didn't realize that was on the menu now. I don't want to buy polished diorite. Let, let me sell you more stone. Buy more stone. Please. Ooh, he sells fox. And white glazed terracotta and magenta terracotta. I'm probably going to want some of the white glazed terracotta anyway. You're feeling improved. There we go. There's that quartz. Give me that quartz. Oh, we got another guy who sells glass. Nice. I mean, I almost want to buy the magenta terracotta because we got plenty of bone meal to dye it white. Looks good to me. Yeah. Looks good to me. Come on. Alright, I'm handing our Arcadia this computer back. Okay. Are you going to hop on yours this time? No? Okay. No point in your hospital. Yeah, I, I just noticed that. I'm <laughs> surprised you didn't open up the shulker here and get the last like, shulker full of uh, paper out to do that too. Oh, yeah. Oh, good. This guy buys andesite. Yeah, I, I need to... I'm probably going to need to call it a night soon anyway. Okay, good. We got a couple of them. We might get another one somewhere around here too. Maybe I'll toss them into this corner here. I, beyond, I know I'm going to want to do something. I just don't know what. Oh. Hi, friend. I didn't realize you had more XP to give. I don't know. I mean, with, with as much Often equipment as has been lost here, here lately, uh, <laughs> you know, that 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 could be uh, that it could be good to have them around just in case. You know what I mean? That's a yes. <laughs> uh, ooh. Do we already have a fortune guy? Uh, I believe so. Over in the hut. Okay. Because this guy's got fortune too now. That's a yes. It never hurts to have backups. No. Yeah. And he may have it for cheaper because I don't know what. No, he doesn't have it for cheaper. <laughs> You're like, 
<laughs> yeah. Like, no, nah, he, he definitely does not have it for cheaper. But no two ways about that one. No, I got four of my shoulders back. <laughs> Oh, uh, good. Well, now that we get a now we get a ready supply of glass, that that's definitely going to come in handy. Did I did I see somebody wandering around here? I didn't want to be. No. Okay. For a split second there, I thought I saw a patrol getting ready to come through. I was like, nope, nope. <laughs> that's a that's a nope. Hard pass. Hey, this guy sells name tags now. Yeah. Yeah, we we got that guy that sells name tags. We got at least two, two or three over there that sell glass, which means I can uh, top off my uh, my honey block farm over here, and I don't have to worry about it running empty anytime soon. And I got a couple of name tags. Four that sell glass. We have four. Okay, good. Uh, let's do this. Let's get. It. If I were me, I would have put the bone meal here. Apparently, I'm not hungry enough for cake. Who isn't hungry enough for cake? I mean, seriously. <laughs> Who goes? Nah. I, all right. Uh, white terracotta. More glazed terracotta. Uh, <laughs> I thought I had more sand in a different. You know what? There we go. That's going to have to go there. Uh, space, the final frontier. These are the voyages. Do I not have a spot for glass? I do not have a spot for glass, because I've been using it up as fast as I've been getting it. Oh, look. I have a spot for glass. <laughs> Oh, bricks. That's right. Um, oh, shoot. Baby, shuffle space, shuffle space, shuffle space. Oh, I had lanterns. Okay. These are uh, some busy bees. <laughs> yeah. That's uh, okay. so particular about uh other than I'm always particular Okay, that'll work. 
Uh, I can't wait to get that started too. Yeah, I think that might be what I do uh, for the for the Nether. I'll, I'll put a uh, honey block slide <laughs> down and uh, in a chain to climb back up. Wait, why am I putting that there? I uh, there we go. Is there anything else I need to do on stream before I wrap up? That one thing. Yeah, I know. There, I, there, there actually was something that I wanted to do before I forgot. But I've already forgot. <laughs> oh, I still need to. I, I need to leak this. But here. I've got the crimson planks. I still have plenty of oxidized copper. It's not like you got to worry about waxing the oxidized copper, too. What's it going to do? Rust even more? It only goes that far. <laughs> uh, is cut copper the only slab? Yes. Okay. So that, that kind of limits the roof palette just a smidge. Because I'm probably... Well, no. I might do the full blocks for the roof. So I got two blocks up. That might be it then. I'll do the stairs... Upside down stairs, one block in. And then the full block, one block in, and above that. And I'll fill up the void space with uh, stone. Because what else am I going to do with it? No, I'm going to sell the stone for emeralds. I don't know. I'll figure something out. Maybe I'll make him like a uh, little secret passageways. Make this a giant game of Clue. Where you take the secret passage from one room to another. <laughs> wow. Oh, I... I wonder. I wonder if you could do a... Uh, make make a make a little like floor plan and do a game of clue in minecraft like like make up the named items for with the player heads and uh what like rename professor plum uh miss white and all that mr green oh yeah no the zombie weaponsmith side will definitely be mr green or the drown. <laughs> Mr. Green, Professor Plum, uh, Miss Scarlet. Yeah, you know, just do do all do all the heads and have that be have that be the card. Uh, ooh, and then mix them all in. Uh, yeah, we could probably do that. We could probably figure out a way to do that. Colonel Mustard. Yep, Colonel Mustard. There's yeah. That, now that I. Hmm. I don't know if I'll do it with the mountain base, but uh, I'll have to see. I'll have to figure out a way to do a game of Clue in uh, in Minecraft. <laughs> oh goodness! Yeah, I know. Ray Est is over there, just off camera, going in the dining room. Of course, we'd still have to come up with the uh, with the weapons too. Of course, the trident. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, well, that that would be the question: is do we do that, or or do we take like the iron bars and rename it iron pipe uh, and all that, and try to get the actual, you know? Uh, and I haven't opened up a box of clue in a long time. I haven't watched the clue movie in a long time either. I might need to do that too. I don't know that you want to do that, sir. Why? Is it is it not held up? Oh yeah, that's right. I haven't started digging that part yet. I can get a second floor going there. I'll have to make sure I get a matching balcony on this side. I don't know what's going to be on that side though. Uh, I know I got a couple of a couple of crop farms that I didn't fit in here like uh, somewhere I want uh, 
a setup similar to these guys, but for glow berries and glow lichen. Uh, the glow lichen you have to sort of manually harvest. Um, but th there's a way to kind of get around that. I'd need to get a vine farm set up, and I would like to get a cactus farm. Uh, let's see, pickle and kelp farm. Uh, find out where the ginormous melon pumpkin farm's going and do that somewhere. And uh, I've heard... I, I, I know there's a way to do a moss block farm, too. I don't know... I don't know how much... Uh, I don't know if there's going to be enough of a call for that yet, or if nobody's quite gotten to that part of the uh, the crafting stuff. Uh, either way, even if we end up with more moss blocks than we need, we can always turn it into bone meal. Although we got bones. Let's say we got bones coming out of our ears. We we got we got bone <laughs> we we got bones for days. I am not necessarily complaining though, because uh. We got doggo tritos all over the place. I need to go. I need to go get a find a dog for myself too, so I can. I can deliver two to you. Uh, yeah, but they're not mine. I need to go get my dogs. I mean, you know, tomato, tomato. I mean. Look who gift dog in the mouth. Huh? Let's go there. You're killing me, Smalls. <laughs> all right, let me make sure all my all my pressure plates are back. Yeah, I, I'd love to put one there, but there's nowhere to stand on here that you're not on the pressure plate that opens the door behind you. Yeah, it sounds perfectly. Uh safe. I mean, no assassination could happen like that. No, 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 nothing bad would ever happen there. Mm -mm, nope. No, nobody would Perfectly safe. Nobody would stab me and say, the villager sends his regards. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. Now, that, that's when you know you're punchy enough to go ahead and go over to the credits and say, Thank you for joining along. I hope you had fun. Sorry about the late start. Uh, my schedule has been all over the place. So all I'm going to say is 6.30 adjacent on Tuesdays and Fridays I stream. Tuesdays is always Coffee Craft. Fridays is up for grabs right now uh, until I can get a handle on things. Uh, <laughs> one day. One glorious day. Let's go see who's available for a raid. And... I'm trying to double check and make sure that Beast Lord J really isn't on. Because there's been a couple of times that he was actually on, but it didn't show up on my list of channels to raid uh, for some strange reason. Uh, so we are going to go go ahead and raid Grimly, who is playing Lost Ark. So I'm going to hit the, the title screen, stick around for the raid, and I will see you next time. <laughs>